week ago, Soresco police officer Ross Bartlett tragically died in the line of duty when he was on the side of the road conducting a traffic stop just a few miles south of Soresco. And today, family, friends and first responders from across the state celebrated his life with a funeral service and procession through Lincoln. 10 11's John Grinvalds was there and he joins us live in the newsroom with this story. Madison Cole, a somber memorial for a man who touched so many lives. Ross Bartlett was a father, friend, and first responder who leaves a hole those who knew him say can never be filled. Ross Bartlett's death stunned the community and wider Nebraska into silence, drawing words from Governor Jim Pillen in his address to the legislature yesterday. Please join me in a moment of silence and prayer in honoring Officer Ross Bartlett. Today, that morning grew louder at a funeral service, touching on memories of Bart. Ross's life not had value, it has value. It has value. And giving him a rifle salute. As first responders from across the state prepared a sprawling procession through Lincoln, escorting Bartlett's body from St. Mark's United Methodist to Roper and Son's funeral home, Bartlett wore the blue most of his life, working for almost a dozen first responder agencies in Nebraska across his decades of service. And today, hundreds gathered to make the case that though he may be gone, he'll never be forgotten. There was no burial service scheduled today. We'll hear from more people at the procession coming up at 6. Reporting in the newsroom, John Grinvalds, 1011 News. We are certainly thinking of those who knew him and loved him. John, thank you so much.